Hi guys, my name is Peter Rodner. My name is Peter Rodner. And today we're going to show you how to use a new application. So listen up, don't go anywhere. Hi guys, so this is the application we're going to be using today. This is called Split Video Recorder. You can find it on the Google Play Store. When you go on, you're just going to search for Split Video and Camera. And this is going to show you how to use this application. So as you can see, the icon shows up right here. When we open it up, it's going to go directly to your choice of a camera or video. Okay guys, so we're in the camera view right now. Um, on the left hand side, they do give you options for other splits, but that's only in the paid version. Over here you have some effects if you want to put it onto your picture, such as invert the color, make it black and white. Um, you can use those if you want. I'm just going to keep it on regular for this tutorial. On the right hand side, we have here um, a flash. If you want to use a flash, you can turn it off or on for the camera function. Um, but here, since we're actually going to take a video, these are the ones we're going to be using. So first off, this is the button that you'll actually record the video. Here you can switch the camera around, so I'm going to switch it around. And you can see my classroom right there, so let me switch it back for right now. And on the bottom here, what you want to do is you want to set a timer. That way you have time to get into position for each one of your shots. So usually 5-10 seconds should be more than enough. You do have to move a little bit quick, so let's try to do it right now. Using the 5 second function, I'm going to turn the camera around. Okay. And I'm going to press this play button right here, and it's going to count down to five. You'll see it. And I'm going to have to get into position within that amount of time. On the left-hand side is where the picture first one will be taken, and the second one, you can see it's a little bit foggier. That'll be my second video. So here we go. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to put a five-second timer on, and I'm going to press the record button. It's going to give you five seconds to get into the left-hand side of the photo. Once it starts recording, you'll see on the top right hand corner, there's a little red record button and you're going to act your parts. Once it's done, it'll automatically stop recording after 10 seconds. You then need to go back up to the tab and you need to press the play button. And then you'll see your first video. When you press the button again, it'll show up a five second timer and you need to get ready to get back in the shot. It's going to play the part that you just recorded, that way you can see the part, and then you can put in your part for the second. So once it's completed, it's going to take less than a minute to process the video, it doesn't take long at all. And once it processes, you're going to have a second to take a look at your video again. So let's take a look. Wouldn't it be great to have a twin who could do all your homework for you? Thanks to cloning, you can! So, if you like the video, you can then save the video. It'll save directly to your gallery. So let's take a look at what the video looks like. Wouldn't it be great to have a twin who could do all your homework for you? Thanks to cloning, you can! So I hope this app tutorial has helped you guys out. And if you have any questions or want to leave a comment, write down at the bottom. Have a great C2 class.